They may have beat me before, but it's time for the ultimate challenge. I'm going to whip their ass. Are you ready? In your dreams. Yeah? Very ready. Let's go. Okay. Ladies first. Are you in a good mood or a bad mood? Medium. Thank fuck for that. So we're all doing apple desserts, yes? Yeah. Okay, the yeah, perfect I'm doing dessert. a simple apple dessert. This, the perfect dessert to follow pork. Yes, Janet? Now, the most important thing about this challenge, okay, the winning dessert is going to be served in the rest of the evening straight after the main course, that, yeah? That's a bit of pressure. Right, Janet, what are you doing? Surprise baked me. Baked apples. Do you think the diners are going to want to pay for a baked apple? It's so simple, I've gone to Harrods and bought mincemeat. Has it got suet in there? It, it has got a tiny bit of suet ah, in it. A little bit of beef. But not a beef. lot. Watch your ass pulsating in those jeans Look at again. That. Yeah, why are you? Why have you got pastry exactly? Because, because I'm making a, a rice pudding apple tart. Oh so I've got pastry, God, the filling, I've got a custody tarts. rice pudding filling that should set very nicely, and uh, the apples are going to go on top, just sort of lightly fried in a little bit of butter with a bit of sugar, slightly caramelised. But you, before people before this, have had scallops and potatoes, yes. roast pork. I didn't know about the potatoes. And potatoes are now stodge, stodge, stodge. Not stodge, they'll be fresh apples. I mean, these people will have to lie on the bloody carpet you're, afterwards you're and get over their carbohydrate <laughs> overload. You're ladling in the Harrods mincemeat. It's not exactly Thank a slimmer you. special, but is it? Look at, yes. look, you, that's the hole. Oh. That's the oh, hole that hole. the mincemeat goes in. Where's the volume it's a on that? Hole, isn't it? And that much mincemeat isn't going to make my ass two sizes bigger, is it? It's a small <laughs> hole. It's a very <laughs> small <laughs> hole, I Try to shut her up. I've never managed it in the last two months. Yeah? Have a fucking go, will you please, yeah? So, whilst you's doing a rice pudding topped with apples, Madam's doing a baked apple. I'm going to keep it really simple doing an apple tart. Just a very simple apple tart, but I'm using all the trimmings of the apple to make a little bit of a puree, a little bit of cinnamon, and then a fresh vanilla seed. Open up, scrape out the seeds. I'm going to put that on the base of the tart and then apple slice really thinly. It's sort of wafer thin. And they're going to go all the way the around the tart. Corn. You're slicing yours thick, Hugh, yes? Quite thick, yeah, because we just thick. want one layer of medium thickly sliced apples over uh -huh. the top of the rice pudding. This is so lovely, it's comforting. Yeah, I'm around. going to serve it with ice cream. And when you serve this at your exquisite dinner parties at home to all your friends, yes? Yeah. Do they enjoy it? Yeah. yeah. Do they? I have people queuing up to come round my house for dinner. Um, so I've rinsed the, the pudding rice, I've blanched it and rinsed it, and now I'm just going to cook it, but instead of baking it in the oven, I'm going to cook it in a saucepan with a, a little knob of butter and a splash of whole milk. Right. So just a little bit like cooking a risotto. Right. Well, mine's ready to go in the oven. What? Sorry, loves. We've just started. You've got, you've got to have. Yeah, it. because I'm cooking something that in the real world <laughs> you feel like cooking after you cut the other two courses. The way I see it, this is really kind of a final between Janet and myself. Exactly. Oh, we've both beaten you before. Can you fuck off? And, and you're I just can't believe you finished already, but there again, you had fuck all to do. But I'd take out the jar, stick it in an apple, <laughs> and bake the fucking thing. Doesn't Sorry. Doesn't lovely.